Welcome to this channel. In this short video, we will talk about Ashman phenomenon. Let's get into it. Ashman phenomenon is also known as Ashman beat and Ashman aberrancy. This phenomenon is mainly of academic interest because clinically it is not symptomatic on its own and there is no treatment for it. But anyway, it is good to know. This phenomenon was described by Ashman in 1947 in patients with atrial fibrillation. This phenomenon was detected when a relatively long cycle or RR interval in ECG was followed by a relatively short cycle or RR interval, the QRS complex with a short cycle often has right bundle branch block morphology. What is its mechanism? As you may know, that the refractory period of the Hisperkinji system is proportional to the R, R interval of the preceding beat. So, when two beats are separated by a long R, R interval, the subsequent refractory period will be relatively long. During this long refractory period, if a premature supraventricular stimulus occurs, whilst the Hisperkinji system is still refractory, then the conducted beat will appear abnormal. And, as the refractory period of the right bundle is slightly longer than the left bundle, the aberrantly conducted beat travels through left bundle and typically demonstrates a right bundle branch block morphology. Now, let's come to the criteria for its diagnosis. FISH criteria is used for the diagnosis of Ashman phenomenon. It includes these five points. 1. The cycle terminated by the aberrant QRS complex is preceded by a relatively long cycle. 2. Right bundle branch block aberrancy, with a normal orientation of the initial QRS vector, is seen. A series of wide QRS supraventricular beats is possible. 3. Irregular coupling of aberrant QRS complexes. That is, the Ashman beats occurs at irregular intervals. 4. A short long short RR interval is even more likely to initiate aberration. And lastly, the fifth point in the FISH criteria is lack of fully compensatory pause. And this is it for this video. Share with your friends and subscribe to this channel if you found this video useful.